Studying dietetics and becoming a dietitian was an eye-opening experience, especially as an Asian person in a white-dominated field. Around 85% of dietitians identify as white, and since all my professors were white, they weren't familiar with any foods besides the foods they knew, which were foods like kale salad, chicken, and quinoa. And in my training, I was taught that these foods were healthy, whereas ethnic foods, like the Hawaiian and Japanese foods I grew up with, were unhealthy. Dietetics has struggled with underrepresentation for decades, which can be difficult for people of color who are not properly represented and therefore are told they can't fit their cultural foods into a healthy diet. For a long time, I had a hard time reconciling my own favorite foods like udon, or lao lao with what it meant to eat a balanced diet but then i realized that all foods fit even my favorite cultural foods and that i could enjoy them alongside foods like chicken and quinoa and kale and still be just as nourished so if you're watching this instead of avoiding your cultural foods altogether include them celebrate them and just know that all foods fit i didn't know this sooner which is why I